It's too late to start over. Chloe Moritz was the find of the century. Thought you were gonna give up that refined sugar. Bad for your vocal cords. Bought a little machine for making demos. I bet you're good. It makes you say that. Intuition. After a couple scenes, Denzel came to me and said, uh, she's a real thing. That was the right call, which she doesn't do. She just had it, you know, whatever it is, she had it. She's a 16-year-old girl that walked in my office and sat down on the sofa, and I just thought, she's like a little lady. She reminded me of a young Jodie Foster. But what really got me is when myself and Denzel did a reading with her. And she hit it out of the park with Denzel. OK, it's not professional. Just tell me what you think, OK? Alina, the singer. You and I know what I really am. You understand how much he cares about her like a father? I think you can be anything you want to be. To be Alina, truthfully, uh, I did a lot of research on different people. And I went to this amazing organization called the Children of the Night. She called me up so excited about what she found out. One of the girls told her, girl, you're too skinny. You can't keep no man being that skinny. And she went and put on a couple pounds. And I said, this young lady's in it. So meeting those girls helped me to show who she is. You know, you don't look like a Bob. Oh, yeah? She cracks his code. You look like a Robert. Robert reads books like this. Bob watches TV. She can see things in him that are true. And she can see it at such a young age. I think he's touched by that. This girl is like no one you've ever seen. You know, I love being up at this hour. It makes everything seem possible again. Her moments on screen are powerful. <laughs> Chloe's character, Terry, is with Susan on his journey. When somebody does something unspeakable, you do something about it.